All right, guys, welcome back to the next video on the channel. And today, what we're going to talk about is Cartana and Celesteela, the Ultra Beast, who are back in five star raids as of today. We're going to go over each Pokemon and then see if they are any good in PvP. Let's start off with Cartana. So, Cartana is a grass and steel type Pokemon with a stat of 4156 CP, 323 attack, 182 defense, and 139 HP slash stamina. Its best move set, according to this site, is Razor Leaf and Leaf Blade for that stab grass move set. Plus, you do have Air Slash, X Scizor, Aerial Ace, Night Slash. So, if you are looking at using this Pokemon as a raid attacker or even in PvP, you are going to want to try and get a second attack. Um, obviously, it is a grass and steel type, so it doesn't have any steel moves, so you are going to be taking on that Leaf Blade anyway. And then potentially Aerial Ace or Night Slash, depending on what you're going in against. Um, or what is more prominent in the PvP League that you're running against. Um, not only that, let's go over its defensive uh, typings and also offensive typings. So, it takes increased damage from Fighting, which is a single weakness, and a quad weakness to Fire. And then it takes... a Double resistance to grass and then a single resistance to dragon, electric, fairy, normal, poison, psychic, rock, steel and water. That is so many more resistances than its quad weakness. However, that quad weakness is massive. Uh, moving on, when you're in rage, you are looking at the CP of 2101 for a 100% or if it's wearer boosted, you are looking at 2626. Now, Cartana can be shiny, so you are just looking for, a, uh, basically, it's got, a, it's changed its colour from a yellow here to white, and I think it's a bit more prominent, its head uh, colouring there. Um, moving on to its counters, though. So, as you can see here, Mega Charizard Y is the best Pokemon to take in, with the moveset of Fire Spin and Blast Burn. Followed by Reshiram with Fire Fang and Fusion Flare. And then looking at uh, Shadow, Darmanitan with Fire Fang and Overheat. Moving on to two others, which is Shadow Blaziken with Fire Spin and Blast Burn. And then Shadow Moltres with Fire Spin and Overheat. Obviously, when looking at this, any Fire type with a good moveset, you'll, you'll be okay. Because it's a quad weakness, you should be able to take down relatively easily. Alright guys, let's move on to Celesteela. Celesteela is a steel and flying type Pokemon with the stats 3507 CP, 207 attack, 199 defense and 219 stamina slash HP. Its moveset is air slash and smackdown as fast attacks and then for charge moves you're looking at iron head, bulldoze, body slam and heavy slam. Um, if you are looking to use this Pokemon, I'd say heavy slam and bulldoze. Uh, just to take on those fire types. Obviously, if it is a Charizard, you're not going to do much damage. But you could always change that to Body Slam if you know Charizard is heavily used in that PvP meta. Uh, moving on to its uh, resistances and weaknesses. So it does have a single weakness to Electric and Fire, with a double resistance to Bug, Grass and Poison, and a single resistance to Dragon, Fairy, Flying, Ground, Normal, Psychic and Steel. So they both, both of these Pokemon have huge resistances um, and obviously Cartana does have that quad weakness to fire where Celestia doesn't. Whilst, whilst you're in rage, you are looking at 1,772 CP for a 100% or 2,216 CP for a weather boost. So looking at his counters, obviously looking from here, you could use your raid counters for both. So you are going to have Mega Blaziken, Mega Charizard, Reshiram, Shadow Dalmanitan, Shadow Blaziken, Shadow Moltres, all the fire types that you brought in for Cartana, you could also bring that in for Celesteela and you should be good to go. Obviously it isn't a quad weakness so it is going to do less damage, but they're the Pokemon I would bring in. Moving on to PvP stats, so in the Master League, Celesteela is actually 156 ranked with the moveset of Air Slash, Body Slam and Bulldoze, doesn't even have Heavy Slam, and then move. Moving on to Cartana in the Master League, you are looking at 159 with the moves Razor Leaf, Leaf Blade, and Night Slash. So not they are not very good in the Master League. Let's have a look at the Great League. Even worse, Cartana is ranked 429 
with Seller Stealer, probably doing a bit better. Yeah, 256. So these Pokemon are not good in PvP. So you are looking at Cartana is a great um, raid attacker. Obviously in the grass section. Obviously you can add its second move to take it into something else. But its grass move sets are the way to go. So if you are looking at getting one for raiding, that is great. Um, try and power up as much as possible with the moveset of at least Leaf, uh, leaf Blade and is it razor leaf for its small uh fast attack yeah razor leaf and leaf blade as its attacking moves then you could take in night slash if you really wanted to but other than that guys that's where i'm going to leave this video it is just a quick one to go over the pokemon that are in the five star rate at the moment so let me know what your thoughts are down below Com uh, comment if you are going to be going for a katana as well also subscribe to the channel if you are new and i'll speak to you all in the next one